The French Navy has unveiled plans to transform two of its Lafayette-class frigates into high-seas patrol vessels. This initiative, reported by OPEX 360 on October 16, 2024, addresses an emerging operational gap as the Navy phases out its older ships. These converted frigates will provide critical support in maritime security, particularly as the fleet struggles to meet its operational targets due to aging ships and delayed replacements. The French Navy is currently operating below its desired fleet strength, with just eight Frem frigates, two specialized air defense frigates, and three upgraded Lafayette-class frigates. Full operational capacity is expected to be achieved only when the five new defense and intervention frigates, FDIs, are delivered. However, budget constraints have hindered the modernization of the entire Lafayette fleet, leaving two of the frigates, Surcouf and Gaprat, without the necessary upgrades. Initially, there were discussions about selling these vessels, but the Navy ultimately decided to retain them for use as high seas patrol ships. This decision comes in light of delays to the Batsamar program designed to replace the aging DSTN Orves class patrol boats. These boats, which were initially supposed to be decommissioned decades ago, continue to serve well beyond their expected lifespan, thus creating an urgent need for reliable replacement vessels. The Lafayette-class frigates, developed by DCN, now Naval Group, in the late 1980s and early 1990s, are known for their stealthy design and versatile multi-role capabilities. With a displacement of 3,600 tons, these ships are capable of a wide range of missions, including intelligence gathering, surveillance, and limited combat operations. Their distinctive stealth features, such as sloped sides and radar absorbent materials, were pioneering at the time and significantly reduced the radar cross-section of the vessels, enhancing their survivability in contested environments. Five Lafayette-class ships were built for the French Navy, with the first ship, Lafayette, commissioned in 1996, and the last, Gaprat, entering service in 2001. These ships were not only crucial for France, but also became widely adopted by other navies. Countries like Taiwan, Singapore, and Saudi Arabia built their own variants of the Lafayette-class frigates, often with modifications tailored to their specific needs, such as enhanced anti-submarine or air defense capabilities. In response to evolving threats and the aging of the fleet, the French Navy initiated a midlife modernization program for the Lafayette-class frigates. The program, which began in the 2020s, targeted three vessels, Courbet, Lafayette, and Aconit. The upgrades focused primarily on enhancing their anti-submarine warfare, ASW, capabilities. Among the key improvements were the integration of the Thales Kingclip MK2 sonar system, the replacement of aging air defense systems with MBDA SADRA launchers, and the addition of advanced combat management systems. However, Budget limitations meant that only three of the five Lafayette-class vessels underwent these extensive modernizations. With the two non-upgraded frigates, Asterisk Asterisk Surcouf Asterisk Asterisk and Gaprat, remaining, the Navy found a new purpose for them as high seas patrol vessels. Their conversion will allow them to perform essential surveillance and patrol operations while awaiting the full deployment of newer, more advanced ships. The decision to repurpose the Lafayette-class frigates underscores the French Navy's strategic efforts to maintain operational readiness amid an evolving security environment. With the new FDIs and Batsamar replacements on the horizon, the conversion of the two Lafayette-class ships ensures that France will not be left with a significant gap in its maritime capabilities. These vessels will serve as a stopgap solution, bolstering the Navy's ability to patrol and secure the seas until more modern ships are fully operational. As the French Navy continues to modernize its fleet, the Lafayette-class frigates will continue to serve as a testament to the Navy's ingenuity in adapting older ships to meet current challenges. Their transformation into high-seas patrol vessels is a pragmatic and cost-effective solution, ensuring that France remains prepared to defend its interests and maintain its maritime presence.